Right there folks, welcome back to another video beer review. Today we've got another beer coming out of Allendale and it is a uh, Anvil an IPA coming in at 5.5% ABV. Pick this one up today. IBUs of 77, so we're expecting like a proper bitter kind of, whether it's going to be an old school English IPA or a uh, old school kind of West Coast IPA, we'll find out. Um, I'm saying West Coast, I'll just have a sneak peek at the hops. Uh, from England's last wilderness pat, with a choice selection of some of the world's most re remarkable hops, refreshingly bitter and full of citrus and tropical fruit aroma, brewed in the heart of England's last wilderness, we strive to capture the spirit of freedom and, and adventure that defines the landscape in all of our beers. Um, great British beer. Um, hops are Galaxy, Bramling Cross, First Gold and Columbus. Um, and malt is pale ale, carrot and a bit of wheat as well. I'm guessing to wheat. Um wheat. So the hops, Galaxy, Australian, huge hop. Um, Columbus as well, typically really good for bittering. Um, I used to use it on, as a bittering hop before. Also great as a late addition as well, in terms of kind of giving kind of herbal, um, lightly floral, kind of slightly similar to maybe like a, it's more an intense kind of cascade with, with a bit of maybe Simcoe in it. Um, and then Galaxy is, you know, quite fruity. I, I haven't had many Galaxy beers of late where, you, you know, Galaxy has really shone. Because um, I think last year or the year before, Galaxy became all of a sudden really difficult to get hold of. Um, so I think a lot of breweries started looking to, towards other hops. But um, Columbus is one of those ones that kind of just flies under the radar as well. Bramling Cross, of course, you know, nice and kind of fruity with a light pe peppery note as well. First gold light citrus again um and earthy and kind of hedgerow herbal so yeah let's um crack this one open best before is first or oh, january 24 so plenty of time on it just bought this today as i said um well, let's see what it is glasses chilled ever so fractionally for the water but um I can see on this side that the pouring with marginal haze, that's probably more the glass than anything. But uh, no, there is a, just a faint touch of haze on it. Um, but yeah, there, there you see like a nice kind of golden orange colour. Um, it's like amber kind of hue to it. Um, big old knobhead pour on the back end of that. Nose. It's lightly citrus, so what I can get through the head, it's quite creamy, light citrus, floral. There's a bit of a multi note behind there as well. We'll dive in. Cheers. Lovely bitterness on that. Lovely, really thirst quenching bitterness. There's a light sweetness from the malt. And I say atop that, you've got a fair amount of bitterness coming from, I reckon, again, the Columbus. Um, or maybe the gold, the first goldings. Um, first golding. And then light herbal, biscuity. No, so, and a little bit of pine finish as well. Very light tropical note, but um, yeah, really nice that. Anvil um, from Allendale. See about myself. Give it a go. See you next one. Cheers.